Move the point minus 4, 3, two steps up and one step to the right and find its coordinates, new coordinates. Okay, minus 4, it would be 1, 2, 3, 4. It's minus 4 and three steps up. Move it two steps up and one step to the right, okay? Goes two steps up and one to the right. It moved over there. What are its coordinates now? Okay, since it moved two steps up and it was at the height of three, now it is at the height of five, right? And it moved one step to the right, so this negative four changed to negative three. Find the side lengths of a rectangle with vertices that are given here, and one vertex is not given. Let us first draw the rectangle. First point is minus 4, minus 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 3, no, 3 down. 3 down over here. Then minus 4 and 2 up. Then 1 and 2. Okay, so now I can see where the fourth point must be. It must be over here, like that. Let me sketch it now. There. The fourth point over here is 1 and negative 3. Its side lengths, I can just see over here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This side is 5 units and this side is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 units. It is actually a square. 5 units and five units are the side lengths. Here's another problem about distance between points. John rides his bike from his home at, and the coordinates are missing, to his friend's house at, coordinates missing, and then they both go to the swimming pool at these coordinates. What is the distance that John rode? So I drew here a map about it. This is John's home here, so he rides here, then he goes up, to the friend's house, and then they ride together over there. And the distance is so that one unit here is 400 meters. Let's first fill in these coordinates. John's home is here. Now, from here we will look up to the x-axis, and so what is here, what's the x-coordinate? If each unit is 400, there's 400, 800, 1200, 1600, but it's negative. So this would be ne negative 1600 meters. And the y-coordinate is right here at negative one unit, but each unit is 400. So it would be negative 400. Friend's house, over here. First we look at the x-coordinate, it would be this, just one negative unit, which means negative 400. And then y-coordinate over here would be one, two, three units. That makes it 1200. And swimming pool, one, two, three, four, five. Swimming pool is at five positive units, which makes it 2,000. And then the same three positive y units. What's the distance that he rides? Well, we just check how many units he rides here and then multiply that by 400 meters. Here he would go one, two, three, and then four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. 13 units times 400. Okay, here I multiply 4 times 13 and then tag two zeros to it. 4 times 13 is 40 plus 12 is 52. And then two zeros. So that would be the same as 5 kilometers, 200 meters. A nice bike ride to get to go swimming. Okay, I hope you enjoyed all this.